we're at the last place now um, that I'm going to go to today before I head back home to Konken. Um, and it's a rather nice place. I've been here once before, um, but it's fantastic. Um, so anyway, without further ado, let's uh, let's share this beautiful view with you. Okay, you ready? I hope so. Okay, and over to the first place at Pool File National Park in Udantani have Pamangan Waterfall or Nampop Pamangan. So, what will be here? I have been here before. Now slip then. There's a crow butterfly. I'm not sure which one. There's quite a few different species of crows here I've seen. Very quiet. I'm with my camera gear again, as per my rather strange contraption, but it works. Not too far, I don't think. So Pu Phai Lam, it's a very very small national park in Udon Thani um, and this is probably the worst time to come here as all the tourists come in the winter in December, January I believe um, because it's quite well known for its flowers um, no idea what that says I can speak Thai, but I can't really read. It's not very good of me, is it, I suppose? Um, that's one thing I'm in the process of doing. <clears throat> yeah, everyone comes to see the flowers, not really the waterfalls. Um, and if you come here in the winter, I think it's really rather, rather busy. There we go, waterfall. That way.
It's very, very quiet. I feel like I have to whisper. I'm not sure if there are any mammals here of any size anyway. Um, being so small. Uh, I'm probably the biggest mammal here. Much further now towards the uh, waterfall. Don't think it's much further to go. I think my legs are telling me that it can't be much further to go. Please don't be any further. My legs can talk, by the way. Um, it's very quiet. Huh. There's a nice little orchid of some description. If you like orchids. That's quite nice. Sounds like uh, talking to my brother in uh, back home. Our kid. Our kid, meaning my kid brother. But you don't say our kid, you say our kid. That sounds a little like orchid. I suppose. <laughs> Maybe it doesn't when you say it like that. You are right, our kid. That's what you would say. That's something. Bloody big tree. Some nice trees there actually. Isn't it? And a million flies here. Absolutely millions of flies here. All around my face, like little midges. You can, I think you can see them on the camera. You can hear them as well. <coughs> Not remotely nice, they're just following me everywhere. So what I'm hoping to achieve today, well, in all honesty, just hopefully see a couple of butterflies. I'd love to see a few dragonflies, but I haven't seen a new dragonfly species now for, I can't even remember how long, maybe two years or so. Uh, we have that way, and we have that way. That way, and that way. Mm, let's go down. We've arrived at water anyway, or rather we've arrived at somewhere where there should be water. Few nice rocks. Imagine if they could tell stories. You can see there, there are one, two, three, four, three males and one female. So they're not going to land for a while. They're excited to see the female. Oh, but yeah, they're a beautiful purplish colour, hence, or shall we say, crimson. Yeah. Really, really hot and sweaty today. Oh, there's one. Another one. Probably not kicking it. The uh, stick it's on. Oh, yeah, it's on the fly away. And you can just start making out there. Beautiful purpley crimson, as it's known as a crimson droplet. Very strange mushrooms. I'm not sure if you can eat those. I'm about to sit down, but I don't think I'm going to now. Look. I think these are actually termites. But there are so many. So, so, so many of them. That's a lot. Cool though. Everywhere. I don't know if they're actually feeding on moisture or something at the moment, or what they do. No idea, but they go all the way down here. There's the cascading waterfall. Oh my god. Hmm. Not much to look at right now. But I don't mind. Yeah. Very, very slippery, yeah. That's a little feature, but not particularly much to write home about, I don't think. Not like some of the radiant torrents I've seen, and we will see much better.
as with most places in this island, it's a bit of a late season place. Actually, now I'm not convinced that the other one was the waterfall. Maybe this is it. There's certainly no water in it. Ooh, there we have. Oh, hopefully, don't scare him away. Now, this is not a butterfly, it's actually a moth. I'm not even sure of its name. Up over there. You can see him. Beautiful thing. It's a, a dineural moth, meaning daytime moth. And you quite you don't see them that often. <coughs> but he's a beautiful specimen. Look at that. I'm put the camera down. Carefully. Yeah, very nice fish. There's a bee in there. I'm sure there's a frog. Ah, now that's Slightly different kind of frog there. Huh. There's not a nice little stripe on his back. Cool. Hello, Mr. Frog. What you knowing? Watch him jump. <laughs> go, mate. Ooh, he didn't really want to go. He likes it there. Good eye. See if we can get in on this guy. Or featuring Glaucum. Oh, words to that effect. Can I get in on it? Can I just see now that leaf with pastel blue colour? There he is. Oi, and he's just gone. Ah. Uh. I needed that. <clears throat> I don't know what the real name is. And I believe when they're all in flight, lots of butterflies in flight like this. Mm. It's known as a kaleidoscope of butterflies, I believe. <coughs> I think. <laughs> Could be wrong. Where are we going now? Oh, skink, 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 skink. I don't know. I think he's feeding on uh, plants or something. There, right there. I believe I've got the last skink. No one there. Just seeing them between the leaves. There you are. <laughs> He wasn't waiting there. Oh, hmm. I think it's reached its natural conclusion here. Okay. So there are many other places to go out here, so... <coughs> Excuse me. I have a frog in my throat. I'll use to finish. Let's move on. We'll go to the next place at Poo Phylon. What else does it have to offer? Wow, well, okay, after the waterfall, I'm, uh, another place. Not my usual scene, I must admit, but you can't come to Poo Phylon National Park and not come to this bit. Uh, so I'll just take you straight to it. And it's of course the flower garden. I'm not actually sure of its name. If anyone can read that in Thai, please help me. Uh, but it's a lovely little place that we've worked out. And let's take it around. Loads of flowers. Mm -hmm. This is what most people come to see when they come here. It's a nice place. It's great for selfies. It's very nice. And the good thing about coming midweek, there's nobody here. You know, what a time. Look, not bad at all. You know, love a little one mill there. Probably a few butterflies knocking around as well. 
Pufoilam Botanical Garden. There you go. That's what it actually is. It's very, very nice indeed. Well put together. Perfect place to come for like young couples, uh, families, and ooh, nice little butterfly there. Don't know what he is. And of course, um, anyone that's just interested in selfies, at least I'm probably showing you this the wrong way round. It goes on forever up there. That's lovely. Very, very nice indeed. As you can see, just over there, on the hill. Lots and lots of nice plants. We've got some dinosaur type things over there. Places to sit and take selfies. And what a nice little place just to walk, you know. Lovely. Just sneak on the grass a second, I hope you don't mind. Okay. Very, very nice indeed. Lots of butterflies. Oh, that's quite nice. Yeah. Hats off to them there in Nudantani. I made a nice little thing here. That's a heaped. If you so wish, you can all see all the flowers. There's a nice bench there. Yeah, nice little pond there. Quite cool. Oh yeah. Okay. I don't even know what the viewpoint is. flowers if you're into that kind of thing. <laughs> Very nice. So that's your bag. It's like the Christmas tree thing. We used to have in England at Christmas time. Don't know about the red one. Put it on. A big clipper. Uh, ha ha ha, I'm assuming that is the viewpoint. Okay. Well. Swings, if that's your things. Swings and things. Wow. Anyway, I've made it to the viewpoint and uh, I'm really rather impressed. It's a nice wooden board, I'll show you in a second, but this is what you can see. Not too shabby at all. Nice little viewpoint there. And loads of butterflies down there. Enjoying the uh, yellow flowers, whatever they are. Yeah, what a nice place. And being right on the edge of Udantani and being free, I think we should have more people coming. Oh, I do believe it's very, very busy in the, uh, the winter. Lots of people camping. These are quite cool, I've seen more and more of nowadays. These things here, obviously it tells you what it is there, but if you scan that using your phone, it'll uh, take you to a link uh, on their own database and you can actually work out what things are. Yeah, do a little bit more research on maybe solar, that's quite interesting. Anything to get people more interested in uh, nature is a good thing in my book. There you go, nice little caterpillar to finish. I'd like to touch him, but I'm not going to. I can give you rashes, I believe. 
Yeah, cool dude. It's like a 1970s haircut. Oh, I got a I song for I don't know if I Okay, cock and a cat, thank you. Okay, so we're at the last waterfall here now. And top coin now. Awesome, what's that effect? And it's a great distance of 200 metres away. Uh, I'm not even going to take photographs. Yeah, welcome. Yeah, I don't know why I want it. They like to come and take photographs of you. Um, which is fine. If ever go missing, then uh, it's good. They can come and rescue you. <laughs> Test to this skink territory. Skinks and lizards. Dangerous, I don't know if you can see that. I'll go over to it. Uh, some heavy duty boulders there. Where's the best way to get down? I don't even know. Over there. Whoa. <laughs> These are quite steep. And over we go. Cliff, danger. Yep, it's quite high actually. <coughs> ha ha, and second time look it. Ah, just Leap of faith. Hoi! Might as well do it again. Hoi! Cool. Again, nice view. Dangerous. Underlie. Not bad views again there. No? Some nice views for free. Cool.
Really cool rocks. I don't think these are found overnight. Oh, that is the waterfall. Or oh, should be. No water here yet though. out to that cliff face. Just a quick trip around there, just looking at some rocks and stuff really. Rather nice. Very old rocks indeed. Dangerous again. That's where I sat before. Nice little cave. Very small. Captain Caveman could have lived in there. As you can see from up here, it totally changes. Hmm. Oops. Something's happened there. Hmm. Wow. What on there? What do we have? We have a dragonfly. Could be of interest. Or not. Some common dragonflies again. Nice little open bit here. Not much water though. Like a deer. Two toes, potentially. Uh -huh. huh. No idea. One last place to go, and that will be it for today. That's why I want to leave now because time's getting on. Tick, 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 ticking on. Last place now um, that I'm going to go to today before I head back home to Konken. Um, and it's a rather nice place. I've been here once before, um, but it's fantastic. Um, so, anyway, without further ado, let's uh, let's share this beautiful view with you. Okay, you ready? 
I hope so. Danger, steep cliffs. Not too shabby, eh? As far as I can see. Unless we can see further than over the hill there. But that's quite enough view. Very, very cool. Just sort of place you could turn up, have a nice little picnic. Just make sure you don't fall off the end of there. Whoa, that's quite a steep drop. If anyone goes down there, they're a braver man than me. You see, it's like a sheer cliff face. Just down to the bottom there. So I'll leave you there. I hope you enjoyed my little adventure to Poofoulon National Park. And I hope to see you again in my next adventure. Take care. Sarah for a bit.